Okay, then students back out at the MedCart, you would document your medication administration. You would take a look, we're documenting for the 10 a.m. medications, so you would, um, whatever date you're doing your return, today happens to be the, um, the 12th, I guess it is, February 12th. So I'm gonna go through and put my initials here. TV. I'm gonna do my initials here, my initials here, and I will also, Oh, on this one, I guess there's no place for me to actually make my signature. Well, I'm going to do it anyway. I'm going to put my initials here in the bottom rung. Put my signature and title here. And then what I also want to be sure to include um, on the line within the medication is the blood pressure, which I said was 120 over 80, so they know Anybody who checks back will know that you check the blood pressure prior to administ administration. And then if you want to do the same thing in your warfarin, you checked the current mar or the current INR and found it to be 2.0. It never hurts to document those things to cover yourself in the event of any type of mishap. All right. And with that, we are done. Thank you.